the coordinator of the Chinese training school, if a best Chin uh, Chinese training school, if a best Chinese training school, I beg your pardon, please put your hands together as we invite Efe Shuaibu, the coordinator of the Chinese training school. Is this the way we planned it from the beginning? I think they are wondering because we said Chinese. So they're curious. Thank you very much. Good morning, distinguished ladies and gentlemen. It's a pleasure to be here to stand before you all this morning. First of all, I want to appreciate Ambassador Dr. King. I want to appreciate the Ubon King Foundation and all the board of directors for this privilege given to to us to be here today. I also remember Ubon King today because I was still in China when I'm one of those Nigeria that felt his impact. I was hoping that someday I'm going to meet with him when I come back to Nigeria, but unfortunately, I couldn't see that day. But I'm happy that I'm in this conference today and the opportunity given to me by the foundation by Dr. Mrs. Ambassador King and all the board of directors, I appreciate. Uh, today, I just want to speak briefly on the importance of and the benefit of Chinese language I'm bringing it from the aspect of economy. I'm bringing it from the aspect of economy. I'm bringing it from the part of economy. We all know the importance of China today in the world, in the global world, and the importance of Chinese language that if you have this knowledge of Chinese language, you can speak Chinese language, it has a lot of opportunities within Nigeria presently and even outside Nigeria. I'm one of those people that took the ball, the, 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 the ball by the horn. I was one of those people that I saw the impact of Chinese language in a very early stage and I did everything possible to make sure that I studied this language and today I'm not just a master, de a, a bachelor degree holder. I'm also a master degree holder from a prestigious university in China. I worked in China after my graduation, after my degree, uh, my bachelor degree, and master's degree. I worked in China for two, uh, two and a half years before I came back to Nigeria. And my comeback to Nigeria was based on the passion, the passion to also impart that same knowledge to Nigerians. That same passion is what brought me to Nigeria, and today, time will, time will not permit me to go in details, but if you want to know more about what we can really offer, today the Chinese 
consulate in Lagos is a strong supporter of our school and the Chinese consul general have been was in our anniversary last year and in fact there are a lot of opportunities in there I would just want to end it today because there's no time I wanted to elaborate more but all right okay Thank you very much. Thank you, Ma. Thank you all. And if you want to know more about our school, you can visit our website, www.ebchineseschool.com. And also, before the end of the day, uh, my, my, my student will be at the gate to pass our flyers and also the complimentary the business card to as many that want to have it. So you can reach to us. We offer online classes, live classes, and all that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Can I interview you in Chinese? Okay, Am I the only one that I know in that thing? At a point, I was, it was only like a Benway language from Boko. I said, ah. Exactly. No, but this Chinese is important to learn you to. You know that we are only China money, so. <laughs> so that my, they call it Chin Chin Han, and not collect, so it's very. <laughs> ah, imagine now, you get to a point that man say, God forbid, bad thing, that China colonized Nigeria. You know you have God Chinese name. Yeah. You have a Mary Jane, Chilu. With your evil name, because I was hearing it there, and I was saying, China, yeah, he's one high. I heard ah. that. She knows so it's right. Oh my god. But I got the traditional Chinese man, you see the <laughs> No, but it's good. But learning it is very important. Um, at least speak more than one language. So that you can confuse people once in a while. Because now nobody here knows what they said is correct. <laughs> Only the four of them trust themselves. We are outsiders. <laughs> All right. right, okay, thank you very much. Please put your hands together again for Efe Shwaibu and his Chinese training academy. It's, it's, I think it's brilliant.